Yo, what is up everyone? Welcome back to our brand new video and in today's video, I am going to show you how you can play Call of Duty Mobile in Game Loop Emulator without any kind of lag with 120 FPS. I think this video is going to be very helpful for you guys. If this video is helpful, if you like this video, then please do subscribe to our channel and stay with us. That's all about the intro. Let's jump into the main things. So first of all, open your uh, task manager. After open the task manager, go inside the performance. After going inside the performance, you will get uh, the virtualization section over here. If it's enabled, then it's okay. If it's not, then you have to enable your virtualization. How to enable virtualization? You will get too many of video in uh, YouTube. YouTube, just go and check out and enable your virtualization. After enable the virtualization, if you play Call of Duty Mobile, then you will get above 60 fps i promise you after enable the virtualization what should you do you have to open your c drive or d drive you will get a folder called program folder my program folder inside my uh, c drive after open the program folder you will you have to find the folder called tx game assistance and you will get the ui folder open it after open you have to open uh, shader cache folder after open the shader cache control a just delete everything from this folder So here you can see it's done everything is deleted and uh, the last one it's deleted okay everything is deleted from this folder you don't need anything just close it remove this one so after that what should you do just open the game loop emulator after you open the game loop emulator go inside the settings after you open the settings uh, go inside the engine you have to choose uh, something from here just uh, in memory 4 gigabytes and processor 4 so before put the resolution over here you have to check out your display resolution what is your display resolution so how you can find the display resolution over here so um, for these things what you do just right click on your desktop you will get um, you have to go inside the display over here after going inside the display you will get uh, the resolution display resolution over here if your display resolution like 1300 to uh, 765 how you can put that um, 1300 just uh, press on customize over here just put your value that's it so you have to put your display resolution over here after put the display resolution you have to go inside the model uh, no need to do anything over here go inside the game go inside the call of duty just check uh, 720 default resolution over here and the uh, quality uh, smooth or uh, smooth is okay just choose smooth and save now just start the game and i'm going to show you some in-game settings right now and after that you will get 120 fps so here you can see i just start the game and now i'm going to show you some in-game settings for these things go inside the settings and audio and graphics after going to the audio and graphics you have to choose the ultra frame rate over here ultra mp only just if you choose the ultra mp only over here you will get the medium graphics medium is okay it's a better graphics and now what should you do you have to choose the br mode it's dynamic over here after choose the br dynamic just close the settings and close the game and after that restart your game loop emulator i think you guys are watching right now i just restart my game and i am inside of um, a gameplay and i think you guys are watching my gameplay right now and in my gameplay you can see on left side corner on top uh, my aps it's um, above 100 so uh, if you use my setting and if you use uh, this setting right now then uh, you will get like uh, 100 plus aps i think so so that's all about the video stay home stay safe bye bye and take care